Private John Marvin Seals was a World War II hero. John was a paratrooper on D-Day who led all the other paratroopers to retake France. John grew up in Metropolis, Illinois. His father, also named John, piloted freight boats while his mother, Josephine, did all the household chores. He had six siblings and he was the oldest of them. John wasn't very good out of school, so he dropped out of college. He wanted to be a barber, but when America entered World War II in 1941, everything changed for his family. John joined the paratroopers, while his brother James joined the Navy, and his other brother, Norman, joined the Army. John joined the military in 1941. His first mission was in North Africa on 1943. Soon after, there was more and more missions that followed, and he kept on parachuting and getting better and better on it until D-Day. While descending onto France, he got stuck on a church tower and had to sit there while Nazis were swarming below him. This is a picture of John while he was hanging from the church. While he was hanging from the church, one of his friends and part of his troop was shot trying to protect him and he died because he got shot and was trying to protect Robert was hanging from the church tower and the Nazi shot his foot and then took him prisoner. He escaped from the Nazis and then returned back to his troop. After the war, John was considered a hero and earned lots of medals. Also what happened when he got back from the war was that he realized his brother Norman had died. John died in 1969 because of throat cancer. Everybody was really sad to hear how John died. Every year, people go to his house to pay their respects to the man who saved Normandy. Although he died, his memory will still live on, and he will always be appreciated as the one who helped the Allies help retake France. On the same church that John parachuted on, there's a little dummy of him with a parachute to help remind everybody how the town actually got saved. John was a great father, dad, and overall just a great man who helped save the world on D-Day.